stacking the dishes. You get done cooking supper? You know, she just did actually. But then you get done, just leave it for her too. It's not a big deal, trust me. I mean, this is probably some of the best marriage advice I can give you. She's got it covered, don't worry. On to the next one. Seth, I don't know how many times I've had to tell him to not stack up the dishes. Seriously? Oh, hey there again. Next best thing I can tell you is, the wife loves it when she has to replace the toilet paper roll every time. So, just let it go. Are you serious? How many times have I told Seth to replace the toilet paper roll? There's a new one, right there. Right there. Seriously, men. Fellas. When it comes to getting your laundry put away, just make sure, oh, not a big deal. Just make sure you get somewhat close to the hamper. <laughs> it's pretty good. Not bad. Oh, overshot that one. <laughs> just like high school. Okay. And that's pretty much what I have to do. Just get in the area and she'll be okay with it. Because that's all that matters. It's all about proximity. That one's for free. Bread crumb, bread bread, what the heck? Okay, it's so much to ask. Just put the clothes in the hamper, not around. You put it in the hamper. Close the drawers. Does he have to leave a trail everywhere? I don't know. I give up. <sighs> Just in the process of making the bed here, fellas. You want a good marriage? Just gotta do this every day. Make sure, you know, you get up. Put the bed together. They love it when it's lumpy. Make sure it's extra lumpy. Yep, get the comforter on there. That's looking good. Pillow, pillow, another pillow. So many throw pillows. Uh, pillow. Get tired to think about it. Oh, wow. Pillow, pillow. Oh, I missed a spot. Perfect. All right, and that's how it's done. Babe, make the bed today? Oh yeah, nailed it, crushed it, you know, whatever you want to call it. Go check it out. Pretty proud of it myself. Okay, I'll check it out. <sighs> this is what he calls making the bed. All right, five years. That's what I get. This is pathetic. <laughs> Fellas. Always remember your manners. This is what I like to call the good old cover cop. So what are you in the mood to watch tonight? A little action, a little romance? Maybe The Notebook? Hmm? How about hmm? Dwayne Johnson? Oh, now we're talking. <coughs> Seriously, babe. What? You think I'm dumb? <laughs> you farted. No. Uh, you totally farted. No, you you couldn't hear anything. Well, I smell it. <laughs> no, it's you did it. You didn't hear anything. Oh my gosh, just watch this movie. Thanks for watching another episode of Humor and Hope today, guys. I hope you enjoyed those five successful tips to a great marriage. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below. You get all the new videos. And once I hit 50 subscribers, I'm gonna be doing a $10 gift card giveaway of your choice that's right you pick it and all you have to do to win is make sure you're subscribed and then you're automatically entered it's that easy also last update on July 4th I'm gonna be running a 10k or 6.2 miles to rescue men women and children from the horrors of sex trafficking now I'm joining the movement 30 for freedom to do that and I'm gonna be putting my fundraising link in the description below here so just click on that if you'd like to donate to the cause and yeah I think that's all the updates I got remember this has been humor and hope where the humor is free and the hopes eternal I'll see you guys next time peace